Wow, take a look at this component. Do you want to find out how it's made and what tools are used to make it? Stay tuned. So Robo Challenge was set up uh, about 15, 16 years ago by my brother and I, and we started as um, basically back in school building fighting robots. So we watched Robot Wars back when we were about this sort of size, watching it on TV and thought we sort of want to get involved in this. So we started with RC cars, strapping knives and spatulas and drills on the front. And eventually we got, um, we got better and better and the robots got more dangerous and then that eventually led into TV show work where we found Guring. Robo Challenge, although we're a very small company, we have a lot of technology here. And for us, we are a very fast paced, fast turnaround uh, company. So often we'll only have a few weeks from design concept through to completed products. So the technology and machinery that we have here at our site in Birmingham is critical to our operation. We don't know what we're doing from one day to the next, so we need a machine tool supplier that can get us the tooling we need almost next day or same day. So we work very closely with Guring to actually manufacture tooling to suit the jobs that we do, and the turnaround time of that is critical. So like this part that you can see behind us now, we've got lots of custom tooling in this to make sure that we can get the job done quickly, but most importantly to a really high spec. Working with Robo Challenge has been superb over the years. Um, from the very first time that they came into our trade counter in, in the old Castle Bromwich site, um, to literally have, we've got a couple of drills in stock of a certain size, right the way through to now where we're quite heavily involved with them in their projects, uh, industrial projects, from day one, uh, to be able to supply a complete range of our equipment and tooling. They buy a complete array of tools from us, to be fair, uh, right the way through from the, from the tool holding, through to the, um, uh, the shrink fit machine itself, through to the tool holders, the, um, the drills, taps, reamers, milling cutters, bespoke tooling, pretty well cross section. Um, it covers most of the things that they do. Probably about 10 o'clock at night was probably the latest I've ever had a phone call from, from, from Grant, um, because these guys basically, they'll work 24 hours, you know. Um, they might work all day and then sleep all day but as a result of which then, but having, having a lot of stock around the corner from has been a very big beneficial thing for them and the same for ourselves as well. And it always gives us an option that we can look. It may not be the perfect drill, but when you're looking for something that might be three or 400 mil long and it's a four or five millimeter drill, we've always got something on the shelf to be able to cater for that. So Goering are well known for our cutting tools, um, but we have been making our own tool holders for a number of years now. We've got a HPC tool holder, gives you high clamping forces, low run out, um, it deals with all the forces that come with the milling application. So that we, and we hold that in stock in Birmingham, ready for next day delivery. So to get a good surface finish on this component, it's 7075 aluminium. We've got a ball nose cutter, a PCD ball nose cutter, which is made in Birmingham. Um, so we've got high um, run out accuracy, low lip height variation and we've got a good HPC cutter with strong, strong clamping to deal with all the forces from the milling. So on this particular job, which is a fighting robots crushing jaw, we need uh, at least two custom tools in this. So one of them you can see behind me which is the 6mm ball nose and we're running PCD tooling on this and because we're running, although it's in a fourth axis, we're actually running three plus one tool paths so we're cutting a lot of this head with the centre of the tool so this is a custom made tool for us so that we don't get clogging on the tip of that tool. We've got through coolant on it to make sure it stays clear the whole time and you can see from behind we're getting some stunning results from that. The one critical thing we've found are the tool holders and we find a massive difference between running ER holders, side locks. Um, our favourite is the Guring HPC holder. So we found that the versatility of them is excellent. We use a lot of shrink fit and things in various areas, but this gives us the flexibility of different collet sizes, so we don't need to have 
20, 30 of these holders, we can have five or six and we can still run most of our tooling. But most importantly, it's very low run out. I think it's around three microns run out on these holders. Um, excellent repeatability. The, the holding force is excellent, um, better than anything we've had, including hydraulic holders. And yeah, we use these for nearly every process um, for milling. So at Robo Challenge, we're known for building fighting robots and our work on Robot Wars, but that's not all we do here. We do a lot of very fast-paced turnaround R&D work, and we also get a lot of one-off work for all sorts of weird and wacky projects. And one of those is this. This is a very high-end uh, piece of jewellery, really. But this is made from tungsten. This was machined from a solid billet on the quasar behind us. And this we found very difficult to machine. Normally we're working with aluminium, very fast machining times, but this is a whole different beast and something we hadn't worked with before. So we went over to Goering and they specified some signum coated tooling and the difference in time on this was incredible. So I think we were running some standard coating tooling that were lasting between five and 10 minutes in this. And we ran some of their signum coated tooling that was lasting 20, 30 hours at a time. And the finish we got was, was just phenomenal. So we've been working with Goering tools now for approximately 11 years and we've never had any issues and so when one of our biggest clients came to us and they've supplied us with their five axis grub and trusted us with the manufacturing of all their products we've gone straight to Goering to make sure that that's kitted out with all the latest tooling so we've got all of their slimline shrink fit holders we've got PCD tooling, we've got a range of through coolant drills, we've got all sorts of things in there but every tool in that is kitted out with Goering because we know when we have a failure from our own doing we crash the machine or we just, just need a new tool it means that we can get that instantly, we're not having to damn production to do it. So yeah, all of our trust in Guru for this.